Hi friends, in today's video I'm going to show you how we can resolve the problem of um, Google Chrome updating. Actually I was doing and trying to update Google Chrome on my Windows 10 and this error came up. Actually the problem is this error is not updating and how we can resolve this problem as you can see we are using the latest version of um, chrome built and chrome version but still it is not going through i can refresh and then show you it starts updating and checking and it will show you that there is um, an update available You see it is showing updating and once you will see it, it is finalizing it will show the error and this is the error came so the update is available so we can do some tweaks and I'll show you that we will go to our services first because sometimes the services are disabled and not working properly. So we need to go through the services and try to stop or start them. I'll show you which one we are going to do. This one is Google. As you can see here, Google update service. And this one is right now disabled. So we will go right click on it, properties and then you see make sure that you are on the right um, file or service name and then now we are going to, it is not showing any start or stop option right now so we just apply and then try again in manual now you can see here is a start button so click on it once you will click on it and it will it should start the service in case you see this kind of information no need to worry about the same information it is here why i am showing you twice or thrice because I have two solutions. This is the first solution I'm going to show you. Now I'm going to do automatic and automatic is doing the same. Welcome back. The thing is this service is not starting. So the problem is Either way, we are doing manual or automatic, it is not working. So sometimes it works and when it works, you can directly just um, update. But in case it is not working, so you need to go on this page where Google Chrome you can download. You can try to update Chrome as I'm going to show you. You click on that link to update on this page and they have got steps you follow the steps apply pending updates and it will start updating but if there is no option then it is giving you direct option just to download and you can click if the download is not started I have already downloaded so I'm just going to click on this exe file now the process has been started so it will take around 30 seconds and new chrome version browser will be installed so this is the second option because not for everyone the first option will work but sometimes it works you will not lose any kind of file, any kind of bookmarks, any kind of um, sessions or cache. 
so no need to worry about you are just going to install this new version manually and same way it will be updated like you update your browser directly from your browser update settings It will, it will not take a long time because it's doing very quickly as you can see. So installation is almost done. Here you go. Installation complete. We are going to close it. Now we are going to back to our update page where I was showing you. Now we are going to refresh and you can see here the update is completed now you can relaunch so this is the default way how you do it i hope you like the video and you know now how you can rectify the problem as you can see the version no new version is installed blue tick mark is on the left hand side and this is the version we were going to update. So this is the second way I showed you how you can do it. By, but sometimes it helps with the first option, second option, uh, and the, the third option. I mean, the, this is the last option. You can go with that. Now I show you, did we lose anything or any bookmarks no you see my folder of 2022 is still there my bookmarks and other bookmarks bars everything is there i'm just going to show you the session or downloads i was downloading a couple of things so you see the download which i downloaded recently chrome file and update is not impacting or the new installation doesn't impact to your browser so browser will stay the same so now you can delete or keep this file exe file because our process has been done what we wanted to do thank you for your watching have a great day wanted to do thank you for your watching have a great day